Hey, hey y'all. Welcome back to another episode of Show Me Sherry. Well, today I have a lot to show you, actually. Um, we have a big haul over here, shopping haul. So we've got some Liverpool. We've got some cut from the cloth. We have a couple of Ever Eve tops. A Tory Burch package showed up. Oh, and my rocks box, my latest rocks box. Okay, and a little package of makeup. I'll explain when we get to that box. So um, in no certain order, we're just gonna open everything up and then I'll do a try on at the end and just a wide variety of stuff, y'all. So I just put it all together and we're just gonna do a video, shopping haul video. All right, so, um, so as I show you the items, if I don't know the price, then I will put it down below right there for you. Um, I do know that Liverpool and Cut From The Cloth was sale items. And I think the same thing, I don't know. I don't know, I don't know. So let's just get in here and see what I got. All right, <clears throat> hope you all are having a great day. It is beautiful here in Missouri today. It is Monday when I'm filming this, and um, it is like 70 degrees. If it could stay like this year-round, I would be happy as a clam. I honestly, I mean, I would prefer to look at mountains every day of my life, but if we had this kind of weather without the humidity, I wouldn't complain a bit. Not at all. I love this weather, hence why I love fall, y'all. <laughs> All right, so let's get into the first thing. Look how filthy these packages are. I don't even know if you can see just how dirty. Yuck. All right, so this first one is Liverpool. So let's see what Liverpool, what we have in store from Liverpool. Yuck. Okay, looks like two items. I don't feel any paperwork. All right. So, a top and a jacket. I remember this was on clearance. And I do not have a white denim jacket. And everybody seems to have white denim jackets. So, um, yeah, I decided I need a white denim jacket. But this was marked down so drastically. The um, regular price on this is $119, but that is not what I paid. And it is super cute. So it is long sleeves. It's Liverpool. It has the um, has the stretch and the give to it. But look at the frayed hem on the bottom. Isn't that adorable? I love that frayed hem on the bottom. Um, I like the buttons. I think they're very um, kind of a little dressy looking. I think. And there's some slight distressing, like on the pocket here. Is there any more distressing? Uh, there's a little bit around the collar, but just around the pocket flaps and then the frayed ends. I think it's super, super, super cute. And I got the size large, so hopefully that will fit. And let's see what the tag says. 63% cotton and 30% modal. So it is going to be soft and 5% like a last, no? 5% Elastimol. I've never heard of Elastimol. It's not Elastane because it's got 2% Elastane. So 5% of Elastimol. Tiester. I have no idea. I have no idea what that is. All right, so I am super excited to try this jacket on. And it does have really good give. Okay, so item number one. One more from Liverpool. Okay, here's my packing slip, but there's there's no um, there's no amount, so I will put that down below when I edit, and I'll put down what um, my price was. Okay, what is it that I got here? Oh, okay, it is a sleeveless top. I love the colors. It's pretty sheer. 
but with this pattern, it might not be real see-through. I don't know. Look at those, like teal green and burnt oranges, some brown looking or green. Oh my God, it's so, so, so pretty. That would be so nice with like a burnt orange cardigan over it. I'm excited to try this on. Size large. The original price on this one is $79. And I think it's probably made out of chiffon. Let me see, like a polyester. I don't see a tag. I seriously don't see a tag. The color is Kaleidoscope. I don't know. I would, I would assume though that this feels like polyester. So, so cute. I love those colors. Okay, so that was it for Liverpool. Let's move on to cut from the cloth. Oh, it's big. Okay, so oh, I'm making a mess. I'm making a mess. All right, so cut from the cloth had a clearance. Well, just a very deeply discounted sale. And it was site-wide. So best time, I thought. I thought that would be the best time to get some jackets to try on and decide what I liked best, what color suited me better. Am I shaking y'all? I think I'm shaking you. Sorry about that. Okay, I'll try to be a little easier. All right, so let's see what we got. Packing slip. Just a paper. All right, so we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven items in this box. Yikes. All right, five of them are jackets and two are jeans or yeah, some kind of denim. So we'll start with the jeans first. Oh, I remember this now. Okay, so in one of my, I think it was a Trendsend box, I had high rise Meg Fab Ab wide leg pants. And I let them go back because, um, yeah, my husband was just not on board with that. But when I watched it back and saw all y'all's comments, I decided I think I need them in my wardrobe. But Cut From The Cloth was having a sale. So I got them cheaper than I would have through Trenson. So these are a size 16. They might be a little snug. I don't, I mean, they might be a little loose. I don't know. But they're the wide leg, raw hem, little bits of distressing throughout. Okay. And then the back has a little bit of distressing on the pockets. All right, I think these are super cute and they have a lot of stretch in them. Let's see what the material is. 93% cotton, 6% polyester, and 1% spandex. Okay, so we will give this a go. Okay, and then there is another pair of denim. I believe these were deeply discounted as well. The color on these are bronze, but they look kind of, um, for lack of a better word, baby poop yellow. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. Uh, yeah, they're calling those bronze. All right, cut from the cloth, high rise jean, wide leg, it doesn't say Meg or anything. It just says high rise jean, wide leg. All right. And that is the color. There is some stretch and these are wide leg as well with the raw hem. I don't see any distressing. The pockets on the back look very utilitarian to me. 
and no frock and no frock and no front pockets at all so yeah i'm curious to try this on and see how those look all right let's look at the fabrication on these 99 cotton one spandex so no polyester in that okay all right now let's get to the jackets i think there's five all right, so I ordered in the chestnut that was sent to me through, I think it was Wonderful. And y'all seem to really like that one. So um, this one was cheaper because it was on sale. And so it's the same exact thing, but I'm gonna try it again and compare it to the other four to see what looks better with my skin tone. So we have the chestnut jacket that I've tried on before. And then, this clearance jacket, which I was kind of digging. This is called Nice with New Vintage for the color. I don't know. Um, it's kind of an acid wash style, but I don't know. There's something about it that I thought was really kind of cool. Very bright. All right. Here's the back. Some seams down the back. I like the buttons. They look like vintage, smooth metal buttons, and it does have a frayed bottom. And I just saw this destruction right here. It's like a kind of a little hole, some distressing with a little hole. Is there any on the front? A little distressing around the um, bottom of the hem. So, all right, I'm excited to try that one on and see what's next. Okay. I was really excited about this one. When I saw the description, of course, pictures, you can't ever tell. But when I saw the description, I was hoping that it was going to look just like it does right now. So, I mean, come on. If this is not grease vibes, I don't know what is. It is a coated jacket and so stretchy, but I mean... You know, Olivia Newton-John at the end. Is this not Sandy? I just, yeah, my inner 13, my inner, what, 8-year-old, 13-year-old, 15-year-old, all the different years that I've watched Grease was screaming that I needed to try this jacket on. <laughs> so, y'all, even if this is too small, I don't see this one going anywhere. I got chills. They're electrifying, right? Yeah, that's how I feel when I see it. I got chills. They're electrifying. And I'm blue. in control. I cannot sing. All right. All right. Two more. Now, this just made me happy when I saw it. I don't know. It probably will not look good on my skin tone, but it's clearance and I got to try it, right? Look at this. It's like sunshine in a jacket. Isn't that cute? It's so cute. And again, stretchy. Looks just like all the rest of them, except the sunshiny yellow. Okay. And last but not least, this is more utilitarian design. But the color, y'all, the color is so fall. All right. So the color is mustard. Um, of course, it's a large. But is that not super cute? Look at those buttons and the seams going around the waist. It just looks so slimming. And then it's got those big utilitarian tortoise shell buttons going up the sleeves. Lots of stretch. I mean, this is just fall. This is fall. This is fall in a jacket. Love it. Love, love, love. All right. So that's it for cut from the cloth. Let's move on down to what we have left here. All right, Two Ever Eve, the makeup box, a Tory Burch package, and Rock's box. All right. I'm not sure why they didn't send us in one bag because they're the same thing, just a different color. I would say they probably got them from different Ever Eve stores. So I'm gonna open them up at the, um, of course it fell out. <clears throat> I'm gonna open both of them up because they are the same item. 
and I was hoping it would look kind of metallic-y like what I'm seeing. If I have to send it back, they're going in the same bag. <laughs> okay. All right, so this is LA Made, I guess that's the brand, LA Made Nights in the City Silky Tea. So it's a silky t-shirt. And I got the art the color I got the colors Army and Coco. So here is the cocoa. The cocoa color. It's kind of wrinkly, but it's so pretty. It's so pretty. I'm not sure about that as a color, but oh. I just love, love the way that looks. I hope it looks just as good on. And then the army color. Y'all have been saying that I look good in green. This is kind of a brown green, so I'm not sure, but I just thought it was so pretty. So I cannot wait to try this on. What are these made out of? 100% no. Yeah, 100% rayon, so they may shrink. Of course, I don't put any rayon in the dryer because of the shrinkage issue. All right, so I got those. Keep that handy. Okay, let's do rocks box. Oh, you're probably familiar with rocks box. $21 a month. It's, uh, they call themselves a rental service. But if you want to uh, purchase anything that you get in one of your boxes, uh, that $21 will be credited towards that purchase. It will be applied to that purchase. Um, you can get as many boxes as you want for $21. So if you get a box and you're like, mm, I don't really like the way that looks in person, ship it on back and they will send you a new box. You can get up to, like I said, unlimited. They have changed their boxes for fall, y'all. It is adorable. Look at that. Is that not sweet? That is so cute. All right. This has been here for quite a while, so I have no idea. I don't even remember. Oh, okay. They're having a stock up and save. Oh, cool. Stock up and save. $10 off when you buy two pieces instead of three. $20 off if you buy all three. That's so cool, limited time only. And of course I have a link down below that I will drop if you haven't tried Rocks Box. It is a fun box to get. And it's more affordable because it's only $21. And they have the little fall um, orange tissue paper for fall. Okay, so let's take a look at my little bundle. Inside here is the return label to ship it back, and you use the same box and the same envelope that it came in. All right, so here's my little bitty bundle. It's just like jewelry bags. Okay, let's see what I got. I got something from Rudiment, something from Dusk, and something, it says, from Rocks Box. All right, let's see what Rudiment is. Oh, okay. So there are little star earrings that kind of match that little star necklace that I kept and got one for my mom. If I can get them out of the bag. They're a little longer than I thought they were going to be, but there they are. They would match perfectly. Look at the, I like the movement and the, how the light reflects off of those stars. Those are cute. All right, so how much is those? How much are those? The Rudiment Miramar Multi-Star Drops in Silver, $60, but member price is 51. And, ooh, I have a $25 forever credit. Somebody used my link out there. Thank you. That is such a sweet surprise. Awesome. Wow, y'all, this is so great. Okay, so let me take these out.
and I will put these in. Oh good, they're easy to get on. I had trouble with those Kendra Scotts last time. Oh, those are cute. I like how that catches the light. And they're very lightweight and they're not, they're not as long on as I thought they would be. So let me just, uh, let me hold still for a minute and I will try to do a close up for you. I don't know why I'm whispering. <laughs> All right, those are cute. All right, let's see what else we have. I really like how that grabs the light. All right, from Dusk. Ooh, that's pretty. Willa Opal and Gold Necklace. $70 retail price. $59 member price. I'm trying to get it to where it's supposed to look. Okay. That's cute. All right, I got to try that on. All right, it looks like there's three, there's three opals and then two little crystals. It has um, quite a long adjustable link chain on the end, so you can go really close to your throat or you can or you can put it on longer. That's a good two inches. That might be three inches actually. All right, I'm just gonna put it on as long as I can so you can kind of see it. Okay, there's a, is that how it goes? I don't know, this guy doesn't want to lay down. There. So three opals and then some... And then some rhinestones, some little stones. All right, I'll hold still so you can get a close-up. That is cute, y'all. That is cute. Okay. I'm excited. What's next? All right. Next is from Aster, it says. It's a Willow Toggle in abalone. It's $55, but member price is $46. Oh, my goodness. That is so pretty. Oh, wow, y'all. This is so sweet. I think that's the back. You could probably wear it either way. Or is that the back? Okay, look at that abalone. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, my goodness. All right, I got to I got to put this one on too. My foot's falling asleep. I have needles in my toes. <laughs> It's not very long. Oops. Let me tuck this one in. Okay. There, I think I got it. All right, I'll hold still. That's so pretty, y'all. And then the other side, you could even wear it on the other side. And I'll hold still to that side, too. That's so unusual. All right, so let's see what's in my makeup box. All right, so y'all, this is a brand called Lime Life by Alcone or Alcone or Alcone. I don't know. Um, a friend of mine from high school sells this and she, I have been watching her for a long time and she swears by this makeup. So she's going to actually do a makeover on me for y'all. Um, we're going to, 
They're possibly going to a retreat at the beginning of November. Um, fall in love with Jesus retreat. So I was thinking maybe she might do my makeup while we're there and uh, can get it filmed for y'all. So I talked with her because she put an ad on her page about this miraculous cream, eye cream. And they showed what it did. And I'm like, yes, please. Yes, please. I, I, I need that. I need that. So, um, yeah, I asked her about it and she raved about it so highly. So I got a few things here to try. Like I said, I'm unfamiliar with the brand. So I'll let you know in a future video what I think. So let's see. Let's see what we're going to play with in the future. Oh, there's some... Uh, Cool. They've got some samples in here in this cute little um, folded little package. It's super cute. Okay, so I got a sample for Lime Life Dream Clean. It's a face cleanser. Quench, quench cleanse, another face cleanser. One's for oily, that would be me, and one's for dry. Skin Therapy, it's a moisturizer for dry skin, that's not me. And Cool Balm, which is a face balm for normal to sensitive skin. Cool. I love freebies. Okay, is there something in here? No. All right. And this is guaranteed. It's, uh, this does come with um, a money back guarantee. All right, so I did see that they threw in a gift with purchase, Lime Life Make Make Off, Make Off Makeup Remover Cloths. So those were a freebie. That always comes in handy, right? Here is the product. This is what she's. This is what I saw on her page, and I was like, I need that. It's called Lime Life. I believe it's melon and avocado, Hydra Cloud moisture eye cream and y'all it just like erases your lines <laughs> totally just like erases gently tap a small amount on freshly cleansed skin around the entire eye area even up here and up here um, including the upper lid for extra daytime benefits layer over eye arise serum i don't have that Use nightly as the last step in your evening routine. And this is what it looks like. I cannot wait to try this product. Okay. There's no scent, and it's pretty thick looking. All right. It's pretty thick looking. Okay, I'm excited to try this miracle product. I need all the miracles I can get. <laughs> all right, so let's see what else we have here. Um, okay, four eyeshadows and... A mascara and a lip color okay so the perfect mascara this is supposed to be pretty um, this is supposed to be recommended highly achieves visibly longer lashes instantly the clump free formula contains lengthening fibers that will not smudge or flake the brush head separates and evenly coats each lash for a perfect application every time. So I am in, I'm very intrigued to see what how this is. I love the packaging. It's gonna have to be good to uh, beat my Thrive Cosmetics because I love that stuff. Let's look at the brush. Oh, it's really thick. All right, pretty good size mascara brush. Okay, excited to try that. All right, and then the lips, it's a enduring lip color. The color's Wedding Cake. 
Our enduring lip color applies as a liquid and transforms to a matte velvety finish. The long lasting formula will not dry out your lips and has a subtle dessert like aroma. Use alone or as a base for our perfect lip gloss. So is it gonna smell like wedding cake? It does smell just like wedding cake. Oh my gosh. Ooh. That's bright, y'all. I don't know. That's pretty pink. I'm not sure. All right, we'll have to we'll have to check it out. I don't remember it looking that bright. <laughs> In the picture. Well, who knows? Maybe it's my color. All right, so let's go to the next thing. And then a, a little quad for eyeshadows. And then she picked out four eyeshadows for me that would be good for my blue eyes. Uh oh, I think I got one that's busted. Or maybe it's just. Yeah, it's kind of busted. All right, so there's one. Yeah, I'm gonna have to let her know that one. That one is a mess. And that color is, does it say? Fifteen, that color is 15. All right, and then we I have 14, one and eight. One, eight, 14 and 15 are the colors that she chose for me. Oh good, this one's not busted. So this is color 14, and it's kind of a gold with a slight shimmer. Okay, put that in my little quad. Number one is kind of a nude, a neutral kind of nude, kind of vanilla-like with a little subtle shimmer. And then number eight. Ooh, this is a really deep brown. Looks like a matte. A real deep, dark brown matte color. Okay. All right. So this is what it looks like once it's in there. And I'll talk to her about that number 15. <laughs> So that's what I got to try from Lime Life. If you guys are familiar with Lime Life, drop it down below in the description and let me know what you think. I'm curious. I'm excited to try it. Okay. So moving right along. We have one package left. So this package from Tori Birch showed up on my doorstep. I have not ordered anything since I did that Tory Burch haul. So what I'm wondering is, is this an item that was maybe an early release, possibly? Because, yeah, I haven't ordered anything. So we're going to find out. Okay. Opened it up. They do have the neatest boxes. They just open up like this. And then I love that they put... A little thank you note on to the in, uh, attached to the tissue paper but for the price they should <laughs> okay so let's see what we got it's in a dust bag it's the kira chevron small convertible shoulder bag rolled gold that must be the metal color in the color meadow sweet Okay. That was so long ago, I don't even remember. Oh, it's like a rose color. Okay. A leather rose color. Chevron. Maybe if I open it, I can see that. Oh, okay. I guess that is kind of chevronish. I don't know. It looks like stripes to me. It's very soft, very supple. Um, 
looks like one large opening with a slip, two slip pockets on one side and a zipper on the other. Okay, so one large main compartment, then you have the two slip sides right here. Okay, and then on this side, there is a zipper, a zipper right there on the side. Um, it does feel, it feels like very, very good quality, very supple leather, smells amazing, like leather. It has the, um, what do they call it, rolled gold me uh, metal logo there, and then ro rolled gold chain shoulder, chain strap, chain shoulder strap. Um, I'm not going to take this off because I'm going to check that price because, mm, yeah, if it's not uh, super cheap, this thing, oh my gosh, retail value is $548. Whew. Wow. I would love to be one of those ladies that could afford a bag like this, but I'm not. <laughs> okay. Let me put it back in the dust bag. It's got the magnetic closure, which I like. Um, yeah, no, I don't, I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. Let me put this back like it just came off the shelf. All right. I, uh, I'll put down below right here how much this is, but I can guarantee you it's um, out of my price range. <laughs> But it's nice to look at, it's nice to feel, see what it feels like to have a quality bag like that. All right, well that's it for my shopping haul. Quite a variety of stuff, right? All right, so um, I'm gonna start the try on in just a little bit, and then we'll see what Show Me Sherry should keep and what Show Me Sherry should send back. All right, y'all, I'll be back in a moment. All right, y'all, it's gotten kind of late so I'm a little worse for wear and Scooby's sitting right over there I'm sure you can see him you can sit there so uh, the two satin tops I can't get them on they're too small so here is the Liverpool um, here's the Liverpool sleeveless top um, I think I could actually go down a size to be honest, but it's super, super cute. I love the colors, but yeah, I definitely think if you do, I definitely think that I can go down the size. And then I have those cut from the cloth wide leg. Um, I'm trying to remember what color this was. Bronze, they called them bronze, wide leg pants. Uh, they're a little long, <laughs> I'm kind of walking on them. So I think this is probably a no. Do you like these, honey? No, they're too long. <laughs> so I would say these will not work. And um, the top is super cute. I just think that it might be a little bit big. You can walk around the house in those and you can dust at the same time as you're walking around. Dusting pants. All right, so I have all the jackets sitting here, so I thought we would just try them on one after another. Um, we've got, okay, here is the chestnut colored. Y'all have seen me try this on in the past, and I think it's super cute. But what I want you guys to tell me, because all these jackets are very similar, is what colors do you think look better with my skin tone? And actually, right now, I'm kind of, like I said, worse for wear, so. Um, so here's the chestnut jacket, and there's a lot of stretch, a lot of give, super cute. But we have this color, but wait, we have another one, or bright sunny yellow. What do you think? Chestnut or yellow? Chestnut or yellow? Basically the same exact jacket, 
just a different color. So what do you guys think of yellow? Let me know. All right, and another one. Or is mustard more my color? This is more the utilitarian type jacket. I think it's really cute. And this one I think had the extra seaming in the back. I don't know, chestnut, yellow, or mustard. And you can pick two colors if you want. And now white. I think a white is basically like a classic. I mean, you can wear that spring, all through summer. Um, I, don't, I don't know if I'd wear it in the fall, but maybe in the winter. I think it's really cute. What do you think? I kind of feel like a T-bird. <laughs> Here's the coated jacket, y'all. It's just a denim jacket with coating. Doesn't it look leather or shiny? This one just makes me happy. <laughs> All right, one more. And then the 90s acid wash style. I don't know. Okay, so I need you to vote. 90s acid wash, grease jacket, white, mustard utility style, bright sunny yellow, or chestnut brown. I believe that's, I think I covered them all. Let me know down below. Let me know down below. And if it's a little snug like this one is, I'm not worried about that. I'm just wanting to know about the color. And these pants are a no, and I think the top is a no because I think it's um, too big, too big. So I'm gonna wrap it up. It is getting very late tonight, and I have a date with my husband to go watch Hocus Pocus. So he gets to see what all the fuss is about finally. Are you so excited? I'm ready. He's ready. He's ready. So let's do this. Let's do it. Thank you all for spending some time with me and going through this shopping haul that uh, kind of accumulated in here. And let me know your choices and your picks. So until we meet again, Godspeed and many, many blessings. Bye, y'all.